and I was married, but I went home and I couldn't get them off my mind, so this is what I did. I wrote this poem called His Lips. His lips, oh, his lips, so oh, soft, full, sweet, luscious looking lips. When he speaks, I watch his lips in motion and my body tingles, my mouth waters, and I'm filled with emotions. Those lips, his, do not belong to me, but to her as I have a pair of my own. Oh, but wouldn't it be so nice if his lips could be alone for just one starlit, moonlit night? But it just isn't right to cross the married zone and to venture into lips unknown. His lips are full with heaven and hell, and I just want to place mine on his, spreading them apart with my own so I can feel his wet mouth on mine, to kiss his lips, sucking them, devouring them until his body longs for more. Isn't that what a fantasy is for? Thank you. <laughs>